there's something I have to ask you about your relationship with Dr. Otabel, because part of the narrative that was carried out was that you are so close to Dr. Otabel, like a son of his, and so that the board chairman's regulatory function over the management was failing because of your relationship with Dr. Otabel. How, how do you respond it's to that? It's rather the opposite. The if opposite? It, it, yeah, yeah. If anybody pulled the brakes, it was Dr. Otabel. Believe you me, Paul. Because, because you have a very good relationship with yes, him. Yes, but what he said, as chutes man who speak truth to power regardless of who you are. You can sleep in Dr. Otobu's house today and if Dr. Otobu has to tell you what you did was wrong, it's not going to change. He'll look you in the face and tell you it's wrong. And he's one of the people. I mean, look, in board meetings, Dr. Otobu displays such level of intelligence. Bankers. You know, Hari Usu, he was the yeah, chairman yeah. of uh, Ghana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, he was former banker. Mm. He could ask him, Mr. Chairman, where do you get this level of skills? Bankers will be asking the chairman his level of astuteness. It's amazing when I hear people talk about the fact that um, he didn't have um, understanding of what I, I, it's, it's something, of course, like I said, this is the right time I failed to speak. But if anybody pulled the brakes, if anybody disciplined William Atwisian, if anybody had influence to bring to bear, it was Dr. Otterbill. And the how then does it, so is this propaganda? Is this a, a narrative that people have created? It's unfortunate. Mm. It's unfortunate, Paul. It's unfortunate. It's unfortunate. He's a holy, sacred man of God, and believe you me, his integrity is on par. What you see the man in, 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 in secret, that's who he is in public. Mm. It's amazing. And I'm saying this without fear of favor, but he's one man, his yes is yes, and his no is no. So he, 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 how he, can, he led the board. Paul, and, how, can, how can anybody even think about that? 482 million. Ezekiah Abaze, why are you taking it to? Why are you going to put it? Why are you going to hide it? Who does that? Paul, let's have you All pray right. for the nation. Father, we want to thank you, we want to bless you, we want to give you praise. The Bible says that we should pray for our leaders that we will live in peace. We pray and lift His Excellency the President into your hands. We ask of God, you will make wisdom abound unto Him. Spirit of God, we pray that you're going to give, give Him creativity. We pray for all the leaders that He had recruited to help Him in governing this nation. And we pray the Lord, you're going to make grace abound unto them. Spirit of God, we silence every spirit of division, every spirit of antichrist, every spirit, bloodthirsty spirit lurking around our nation. And we take authority and we declare that this land is the Lord and this land is our birth. And we speak that the healing of heaven will be the portion of the nation Ghana in the name of Jesus. We declare that peace will reign. We declare that justice will reign. We declare that goodness will reign. We declare that progress will reign. We pray for healing of our economy. We pray that Lord, you will intervene in the crisis we find ourselves as a nation because the Bible says that when we call upon you in the day of trouble, you shall answer. And we as a people come before you and we lift up our hands to you and we pray for our nation, Ghana. This is all we have. Americans build America. British build Britain. Ghanaians are the only people to build this nation. Give us the opportunity to rise up to that oppressor and rise up to the manipulation and the conspiracies that the oppressor is introducing at every point in time and give us the tongue of the learned and the boldness and the capacity to rise in the place of builders we will arise and build our nation we will arise and defend our nation and we will arise and see the salvation that the heaven will bring to our nation we declare that this is the portion of the nation Ghana may the Lord bless his Excellency the President and may the Lord bless all his administrators that they will rise to see the pounds and not allow the limitation of the pennies to drive them. We are confident that when we pray you hear us and when you hear us you answer. In Jesus name the Son of the Living God we pray with thanksgiving. Amen. Amen.